Welcome to Wolf Chevrolet. Today we're taking a closer look at some of the interior and exterior features in our 2023 Chevrolet Blazer. This Blazer is featured in the True North trim and is a blue glow metallic paint finish. Under the hood we have our 3.6 liter V6 engine paired to a 9 speed automatic transmission as well as all wheel drive. Inside the vehicle we have 5 passenger seating on jet black leather seating surfaces. We have heated seats in the front of the vehicle with a powered driver seat wireless Apple CarPlay and Android Auto, forward collision alert, as well as lane keep assist with departure warning, and a backup camera. Outside the vehicle, we have black alloy wheels, as well as paint match door handles and black mirrors, as well as a powered lift gate. Moving into the front of the vehicle, we have a chrome finish door handle, power locks, power mirrors, power windows, and our rear window lock. Powered liftgate settings are below and we have stored throughout as well as our speaker. Just inside to the left of the steering wheel we have display cluster and exterior lighting, an electronic parking brake, audio controls on the back of the steering wheel, power driver seat with power adjustable lumbar, and the seat itself is finished in our jet black leather. Getting into the vehicle, looking above our display cluster or above our steering wheel is our display cluster. In the center, we have our digital information system. You can see our odometer in the bottom as well. We have TPM as well as timer, battery voltage, speed. We can adjust our audio, our compass, as well as phone connection and settings throughout. Moving down to the left-hand side of the steering wheel, cruise settings, our forward collision alert, as well as audio controls behind. Right-hand side, voice recognition, hands-free, controls for that display cluster information system and more audio controls behind. Push to start ignition is just to the left of our infotainment and we also have auto stop start and hazard lights there as well. Infotainment system is in the middle of the vehicle. If we go into audio and more, we have AM, FM, Sirius XM and Bluetooth. Phone connection, a Wi-Fi hotspot, users, apps, Apple CarPlay, Android Auto and settings on the first page. Swipe to the right, we have our OnStar, Climate, our backup camera with adaptive as well as a hitch guideline. Sirius XM and My Chevrolet completes the infotainment. Below we have Home, our Seek, volume controls as well as Mute and Back. Glove box release as well as traction control. You can see the glove box is fully powered and all we have to do is lock it back into place. Below that, heated driver seat, we can see it has three settings. When we also have a heated passenger seat. Dual zone climate, we can adjust the temperature by simply pushing up and down on this, and we can adjust our vents by pushing in the center. Have all of our controls throughout with fan, as well as front and rear defrost, sink, auto AC on the right, and power in the center. Below that, in the, between the two vents, USB-C and a USB. Some storage where we can also see our key. On our key fobs, locks and unlocks, remote start, our powered lift gate, as well as alarm system. Behind that, a leather finished shifter, two cup holders with some storage, parking sensors and lane keep assist. Then we have our all wheel drive mode, so we can just simply turn it and we can switch it throughout. We have all-wheel drive, we have sport mode, off-road, as well as trailering. Then we have some storage, leather finish center console with more storage inside, as well as our 12-volt plug on the front. Moving to the passenger seat, also finished in our jet black leather with a powered option as well as heated options. Lastly, above the rear view mirror, we have our OnStar settings, dome lights with dome lighting controls in the front, Universal garage door opener with three settings, and then our sunglass holder. Now walking down the side of the vehicle. Moving down to the front tire and rim, we have our black alloy rim with a Chevrolet bow tie center cap and Continental Cross Contact LX Sport tires. Moving out, we have black mirrors with integrated turn signal, black blazer badging on the front door, and paint batch door handles on both the front and back door. All the way around to the back, we have our black bow tie, black blazer and all-wheel drive on the left, as well as dual exhaust tips. You can open up the power lift gate through the bottom. We just have to simply press. 
Moving to the back of the vehicle, we have 60-40 folding split second row seating. You can see we have our rubber mats that carry on throughout the whole vehicle. If we lift up underneath it, we actually have a storage space with a full-size fifth tire. It's also storage on either side. You can fold either side seats through the second row. If we just pull on it, you can see the seat folds flat. It continues our rubber mats throughout as well. Lastly, to close the vehicle, power release is on the left-hand side or manual release on the right. Moving into the back of the vehicle, we have a chrome finish door handle. Lock is up above, and we also have power window on the door panel itself. Storage and speaker in the bottom of the door. Inside the vehicle, storage pockets in the back of the driver and passenger seat. Two vents, as well as a USB-C and USB for charging. Rubber floor mats, which are featured throughout the vehicle, including the trunk. Second row seats is a 60-40 folding split bench seat, finished in jet black leather. In the center seat, we have two foldable cup holders. Lastly, we can fold these seats. All we have to do is fold up on the side. You can see it folds flat with the trunk, and we can also fold them directly through the trunk as well. Thank you for joining me for this quick video walk around of the 2023 Chevrolet Blazer. If you enjoyed, please be sure to subscribe for more daily videos, and we hope to see you at Wolf Chevrolet soon.